Hey Capricorn, how you doing? It's Mags with White Buffalo Divine. Welcome to my channel. I am new to YouTube. I am not new to the spiritual community and we are going to do your love August 2019 reading. I will tell you, I am so sorry I'm getting this out as late as I am. Please know I already recorded your love reading a week and a half ago. I went to upload it and it would not upload. I even had to call Apple support. Still could not get it uploaded on my computer. Um, I took that as a heavy sign that that reading was not meant to be released. So we're going to redo it. Uh, what you should know, I have cleared my energy. These cards have been meditated and prayed over. I've crystalled them. Um, I do not take reversals in love readings. I like straightforward. Um, and I would also advise you uh, to check out two videos in specific to my channel. One would be the introduction to the White Buffalo Divine channel. And the other one would be the introduction to Tarot Consciousness. It's a must watch. It is a great 10 minutes. Grab a drink. Just watch it. Keep an open mind, all right? So let's get into it without, it, without any further ado. What are the love messages for Capricorn August 2019, please? Capricorn in love August 2019. If this reading does not resonate with you, I hope you come back again. We're already talking. We got cards flying. Oh, you got two offers on the table from two different people. Capricorn in love August 2019. If I have cards fall out, I don't take them. I don't do lazy readings. They got to be plucked. By something other than me. Sorry, that's just how it goes. Capricorn love, August 2019, fast communication. Possible air sign, possible water sign, air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, possible water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Two offers, both are communicating with you out of nowhere. I feel you are possibly single right now, or you are in a relationship and this other person is approaching. You're too busy working. Why? Because Capricorn's about that sh money. Y'all are always so responsible with your money. You are on point, okay? If I'm lying, I'm dying. Knock on wood. I'm not. You're ready for happiness. You are in such a good place, Capricorn. Whatever you're doing, keep it up. The universe is acknowledging it. Capricorn love, August 2019. What are the messages, please? Oh, that was, stop it, stop it. I can't make this up. You got your heart set on the air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You have feelings for the air sign, I feel. I don't want to get too sign specific. Let's just keep going. Messages for Capricorn, love, August 2019. Yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> Excuse me, I have a cold, by the way. So if my voice goes out, I apologize. Yeah, it's water and air on the board. I don't like to call signs. Oh my God, stop it. Stop it. One more. Capricorn love, August 2019. All right, I'm done. I can't even. Y'all. Y'all. Okay, let's talk. Two offers on the table, pages. These are not going to be huge emotional offers, okay? Could be from two males, could be from two females. I am seeing these offers as kind of being like a, <clears throat> not necessarily a face-to-face -face conversation, a possible text message, message via social media, a comment on a photo, something to that matter. I'm not seeing someone talking face-to-face -face with you, but you've got two people approaching and telling you they're interested, okay? Fast communication. Like I said, you're over here being too busy working and being proud of your work, being happy as a mother, okay? The sun is a fiery card. It's a Leo card. I will say, I'm feeling this is your energy because we've got the king of wands. Now, this is a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius card. That being said, I am not reading that as a fire sign entering this reading. That is you in your power. Why? Because we're in Leo season. You will take on traits of the signs of the seasons that you're in if you don't know that. Um, so again, that's your energy coming through hard. You're busy at work. Possibly being very successful in what you're doing or just got a recent promotion or a new job, I'll even say. But here's the thing. So Page of Swords. I feel this is someone um, that you have had some serious feelings with. Could be a possible Gemini. This is a Gemini card, but again, it's definite love. You, I feel like this is your feelings towards them and vice versa, okay? We then have the Page of Cups, 
and the Queen of Cups popped out. Now, the Queen of Cups, to give you that idea of the energy, this is someone who is a master of their emotions because they've been through so much. They have been through so much heartbreak, and that's where they've reeled you in because so have you. But this person's really been put through the ringer, and you know this, okay? They're also making an approach. Um, they both want a family with you. They both want a happy family commitment, marriage, that level with you, okay? So let's get a little bit of clarification. I want clarification on these two signs, okay? So where'd it go? We're going to clarify the Queen of Cups and the Lover's card. We're going to clarify the Water sign and we're going to clarify the Air sign. Clarify the Queen of Cups, please. This is someone you view as being wise. Someone who at one point was a hero to you. You think I'm kidding? I'm not. This person was a hero at some point in your life to you, or you were their hero, okay? <clears throat> Bear with me, I'm sorry. Wise beyond their years. Very into their emotions. They have some emotional intelligence for sure. I'm definitely seeing that, okay? Let's clarify the lover's card, please. For Capricorn, love, August 2019. Capricorn in love, August 2019, please. <laughs> Sorry. You'll see why I'm laughing. Capricorn love, August 2019. Clarify the lovers. There we go. Yep. I want one more. Clarify the lovers, please, for Capricorn. That makes sense now. All right. So this air sign that you have feelings for, you know they have a past, kind of a messed up past. And you fell in love with them because so do you. They're scarred. Look at the scar on his face. However, this is... Someone who has rebuilt themselves on a confident level. They've got a lot of confidence in their emotions. <clears throat> and they've got a lot of confidence because they've really worked on getting grounded with their alignment. Or they're wanting this. I think they're currently going through this process. I don't feel they're all the way there now that, now that I'm really focusing on this energy. But one thing that you fell in love with them about was their integrity and their words. Their communication with you has always been top notch. You've never once had to question their communication. You've maybe questioned their actions, but you've never questioned their communication. And the reason I was laughing is because she's naked. <laughs> We're childish. Okay. Um, so let's find out what you don't see coming with regards to these two people. These two offers coming in. What doesn't Capricorn see coming? So I just got a phone call and I'm hoping that I can merge these two videos. But what I was saying was, what does Capricorn not see coming August love 2019? Capricorn, what do they not see coming? We just had a card fly out. For real fly out, y'all. I want clarification on that. <clears throat> What does Capricorn not see coming? You've got competition. Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I don't feel this is your energy. Hold on. I'm going to get clarification on this one card real quick, okay? We've got the Queen of Earth. This could be you. However, the first card that popped out was this. 
Okay. Seven of fire. Hold, please. I feel like you've got heavy competition. There's there's someone else in the mix. There's a female in the mix with one of these parties. Mm -hmm. You need to look, uh, pay attention to your intuition right now. Look within. Be aware and trust. Heed your intuition. There's a feeling of recognition coming in. There are inexplainable coincidences, moments that repeat. I need a drink. Oh, I'm so over this cold. Yeah. Pay attention to your intuition. There is definitely competition. You already know about it. Deep down, you already know about, you know about this person coming in. And I feel that they're a fire sign. And they actually fell out over the water signs cards. Now, that doesn't mean that's who this is tied to. <coughs> Excuse me. But you've got competition. So it's just saying be aware. I'm not seeing this person, your hero, the person that was a hero or that you were a hero to, the queen of cups, energy, the water sign, the wise one. <clears throat> they're still choosing you. You're still their person, even though there's competition on the table. Okay. But that's what you may not see coming. You may not be aware that there's another person involved, okay? So, let's get some advice from the angels. What do the angels have to say about this, please? For Capricorn Love, August 2019. Spilling stuff. What advice do you have for Capricorn Love, August 2019? Capricorn Love, August 2019 advice. Capricorn Love, August 2019. Go out and have fun, Capricorn. Advice. Whoa. Whoa. Did you see that? Two cards just like flew out. Okay. Hold up. Hold on. Yo. Okay. <laughs> here's your advice. You need to take some serious rest and focus on your work and taking time for you. Your free time when you are not working needs to be on you right now. I would also suggest really going into what you wanted as a kid with regards to love. Was it that fairy tale? Did you have certain expectations or standards? that maybe you've gotten away from because whatever the issue was, um, I feel like there was something to do with your family that maybe changed your perception on love or relationship or, or receiving love. What you need to know the advice coming in is that it's going to be there because you've got everything you need. You already know who you are. And this could be involving your kids, maybe the, these two people. One of them has kids. Both of them have kids. Maybe you have kids together, 444 on the clock. That's a stability family number, by the way. Um, but you're going to be able to break free from whatever may be holding you back from making a decision. You need to know that. That's your advice. Have confidence that you're going to break free because your dreams are coming true with your love life. It will happen, okay? You need to not stay stagnant in that energy. I know you're focusing on work. You're doing a great job from what I'm seeing here. And you got great things coming in. You got it going on. You got two people coming towards you. So get hype, Capricorn. It's your time. All right. So I hope this reading meant something for you. Um, again, I'm really sorry if I can't combine these videos. I'm still, I'm getting old, so I don't know how to do some techie stuff. Uh, I'm going to try to merge them. Sorry, I got a call. I should turn those off next time. Uh, but hopefully I will see you back next month. I'm going to, like I said, do these love readings once um, a month. And in the meantime, like, share, subscribe. Don't forget to click the bell. I can't wait to see you back again. Mwah! Bye, Capricorn.